Hey, taxi! Girls driving taxis? What will they think of next? It's the latest idea from the team who turned so many of our national institutions into riotous comedy. They say all's fair in love and war. But how can a man compete with this equipment? Andrew Chaps for you. Oh, yes, I am, darling. Would you mind taking me to the station hotel, please, and uh, take your time? <laughs> Peter Rogers and Gerald Thomas, who gave you carry-on sergeant, nurse, teacher, constable, cruising regardless, and your laughter will carry on indefinitely. Hello, Charlie. Enemy reported approaching the heath. Enemy approaching the heath. Charge, I love ya! But who would want to change the old-fashioned cab? safety and comfort, they are unsurpassed. Have an accident? No, thank you. We've just had some. Bringing together your favorite cast of stars. Sidney James as Charlie Hawkins. And Hattie Jakes as his wife. I haven't had a chance to talk to him since last Wednesday. And then it was only with his legs. His legs? Yes, sticking out from under a cab. It's not fair. He knows I can't get under one. No wonder the poor girl became his biggest business rival. You've got the job. Kenneth Connor as the shy spy in the enemy camp. This thing's killing me. Could you unhook it for me? Charles Autry. Here, I dear. Try and get that one down, will you? Don't you worry. I will. <laughs> as McCannon. Wagon! Wow! Liz Fraser. Put me and an old engine side by side and I'll give you one guess which one is start to strip down. Somebody's potting. At the turn of the 18th century, Britain was at war. These were the years when history was written in the blood and smoke of mighty sea battles, and the name Nelson typified the spirit of the British Navy. But on board the good ship Venus, my word, you should have seen us. What's going on? What's happening? What's all this jigging in the rigging? Uh, what's going on, Mr. Harriet? We've sighted a Spaniard, sir. What? Where? Oh, she's much too small for us to bother with. We dead. Oh, thank you. <gasps> Bernard Cribbins as Albert Poopdecker RN, as unlikely a young lad as ever went to sea. Before I left home, my mother warned me that things like this might happen to me. I must write and thank her. Juliet Mills as Sally, the loveliest lass that ever loved a sailor. Charles Hawtrey as Walter. Wouldn't you like to go to sea, friend? Like to go to sea what? <laughs> Kenneth Williams as Captain Fearless, who could be seasick sitting on a damp sponge. This wretch is making a laughing stock out of all of us, and he should be punished severely. If I were you, sir, I'd throw the book at him. Oh, well, I don't exactly approve of brutality, but... Uh... Donald Houston as the ruthless Lieutenant Howitt. Now, shake hands on it, eh? Proceed with the punishment, Mr. Boson. <coughs> the order is carry on laughing as Peter Rogers and Gerald Thomas give you Carry On Jack, another hilarious comedy hit in the brilliant Carry On series. Carry On Jack brings you the excitement of the Jolly Roger as the good ship Venus is captured by pirates led by the notorious Captain Roger. Oh, Roger, please, no, no! Who had once been her lodger. Kiss me. No, no, I'll kill myself first. Ooh. Charge! Harder! Boom! Fire! Get that ramrod out! <laughs> This 
was the beginning of a desperate counter-espionage operation. Somewhere in London, the chief of British security knew that the fate of the entire free world hung by a thread. Oh, thank goodness for that. I thought I'd been filed for life. The dangerous haunts of the secret agent... Cafe Mozart, 10 o'clock. ...have been invaded. Oh! The suave, sophisticated excitement of international intrigue has been taken apart. Just now, somebody tried to shoot me. Shoot you where? In the Schnitzelstrasse. Oh, it sounds like it might be very painful. If you haven't already guessed, you're welcome to the worst kept secret of all time. We just can't stop people passing on the hilarious news. It's Carry On Spying. <laughs> Starring Kenneth Williams as secret agent Desmond Simpkin. All ready to get off a slick draw like that, you see? Oh, Mr. Simpkins, that was wonderful! Mm -hmm. They make these things the right way round. Barbara Windsor as Honeybutt, codename Brown Cow. Bernard Cribbins as Agent Harold Crump. Charles Hawtrey as Agent Charlie Bind, who also had trouble with his drawers. Eric Barker as the Chief. Dillis Lay as Lilla, a dangerous enemy spy. I thought it was one of those awful men. I am one of those awful men. Here is excitement to leave you breathless. With laughter, as Peter Rogers and Gerald Thomas bring you the latest in the fabulous Carry On series. Don't you know walls have ears? Yes, and so have I. And you just put your dirty great foot in one of them. And what a Carry On, as they take the lid off the Casbah and show you just what's cooking. miss the startling dramatic climax in the secret headquarters of the infamous Dr. Crow. You have been warned. This film is especially designed to find out just how much laughter you can take. I'm free! I'm free! Throughout all history, the immortal love story of Cleopatra and Mark Antony has fired the imagination of men. Many magnificent motion pictures have been dedicated to their illustrious names. Now comes the most provocative, the most daring, the most shocking of them all. are the epic days of Imperial Rome and the shattering events that led to the downfall of Caesar, the plotting and the intrigue. I must warn you, Julius, there is unrest in the Senate. There have been rumbling. You eat all that spaghetti they eat. See the historic stabbing of Julius Caesar and hear his immortal words. Infamy! Infamy! They've all got it in for me! <laughs> Here are the famous figures of history portrayed as never before. Sidney James as the rugged, handsome lover. Mark Antony. <laughs> Kenneth Williams as the mighty Caesar. Victorious in battle, he couldn't make the peace. Sorry to bother you, sir, but what do you want done with your woman here? What is that? I, I, it's just a little thing I picked up in Britain. Joan Sims as Calpurnia. Caesar's adoring wife. Charles Hawtrey as Seneca, the old sage who knew his onions. Why don't you come on in? The water's lovely. Kenneth Connor as the ancient Briton Hengist Park. Oh, you silly pod. Jim Dale as Horsa. Son of Ethelred. Oh, not Ethelred the unready. Oh, no. No, my dad was always ready. And the fabulous Amanda Barry as the exotic Cleopatra whose beauty besotted the noble Antony, using her power over men for plotting and intrigue. There must be some way we can get rid of it. I have a poisonous ass. Oh, I wouldn't say that. Oh, no, 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 no. I have, look. One bite from this is enough. Behold the beauties of ancient Rome. Oh. 
breathtaking spectacle. Exciting action. Great romance. Many of the greatest films of all time have had as their background that vast, lawless territory known as the Wild West. Yahoo! Many magnificent spectacles, many epic stories have come from this fabulous land. But this is Carry On Cowboy. I wonder what they wanted. I thought I heard shots just now. Uh, it's probably just a horse backfiring. Sidney James as the notorious Rumpo Kid. I am the mayor. You better keep away from my horse. He ain't seen a mayor in three weeks. Kenneth Williams as the mayor of Stodge City. <laughs> Jim Dale as Marshal Peanut, the sanitary engineer they sent to clean up Stodge City. Charles Hawtrey as the Indian chief, Big Heap. Slaughter the pale faces! This is my new squaw, Kitty Cater. I bought her for two buffalo skins. How? Never mind how. Where? Joan Sims as Belle, who ran the saloon. Johnny, she's no good. Take it from me, she's after something. You take it from me, if you get out of the way, she's gonna get it. Yes, this is the Wild West, where men are men and women are... You all know what that means. The night is young, and we're not too old. Angela Douglas is Annie Oakley, a helpless damsel in distress. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. I, I thought you were somebody else. Yes, it's another hilarious hit in the fabulous Carry On series. Big Chief in Little Lodge. A smash hit by Peter Rogers and Gerald Thomas, who have made Carry On the hallmark of the very best in comedy entertainment. <laughs> I know it's the Wild West, but <laughs> this is ridiculous. Could I see the master of the house? He's been dead 15 years now. But if you'll come in, I'll ask him if he can see you. Sergeant, yeah, it's you! It's just it's him. <laughs> you great steaming nut! What are you trying to do? Ride me to death! Harry, I scream in. It's Carry On Screaming. What now? There is something in those bushes. Carry On Screaming, with laughter, of course, as Peter Rogers and Gerald Thomas invite you to join the Carry On crowd on a riotous ride through the realms of hilarious horror. Harry H. Corbett. All right, Mr. Potter. All we want to know is, where is it? Well, love me, it's your police station. You ought to know where it is. Take your boots off. We're investigating a barefoot robbery. Are you sure those are your feet? Of course they're mine. Who do you think they are? Size. Only five toes. Well, how many am I supposed to have? Six! Where's the other one, eh? What have you done with it? Jim Dale. Do you happen to know what Doris was wearing? A dark green jacket and a long green skirt. Did you get that down? Oh, no, as I said, I've only known her a year. Kenneth Williams as Dr. Watt, who's been dead for 15 years, but just won't take it lying down. That policeman's here again. What's he after? The same as he was after last night, I imagine. Fenella Fielding, who causes the copper to come a cropper. Yes, but I don't think you're very experienced in the ways of love. If you want to know the way, 
Ask a policeman? Charles Hawtrey as Dan Dan, the, uh, the... Don't look. Is he... drowned? John Sims. City Bun, you have been drinking. So, this is the step on the final path, is it? Well, you can't say my mother didn't warn me. Get out! Get out! Angela Douglas, innocent victim of a crazy collection of crooks. And two of the most lovable monsters ever seen on the cinema screen. I do wish Junior would learn to use the door. It's Carry On Screaming.